Ah, oh, there you go, friends. Doc South here. And gosh, my uh, my brother's uh, coming over. I'm on vacation. And mostly I've been working around the house, cleaned up the basement a bit, made it a little more airtight, uh, did a bunch of uh, writing chores, did a lot on that book I've been uh, working on. Um, things here around the house, you know, here and there, what whatever I couldn't escape from, I uh, took care of. And uh, all in all, not, not too bad a vacation. Get right down to it. No, didn't go to Aruba. I, I think I had more fun up here. Yeah, tell you the truth. And speaking of that, my brother's coming uh, in uh, gee, about another 20 minutes or so, and we're going to go uh, see that movie about the Battle of Waterloo. I guess it's a new one that's out. There's been others, and uh, I've I've seen... Most of them, I think. Uh, there was one, gee, from 20, 30 years ago, I think, that I saw in, uh, maybe on TV, and that was pretty good. Um, rotten uh, battle. Of course, not too many battles are good. You get right down to it. Pretty uh, pretty hideous things, running around trying to kill each other um, or and not be killed. It's uh, not good stuff. But they, uh, you know, I often wonder why, do you think the kings would get together and say, look, King Louis, King Henry here, uh, how about instead of fighting over who owns this little piece of Spain, why don't we, why don't we get together? We'll have like a, a soccer tournament. <laughs> you know, what the heck? If you win it, good for you. God bless you. It'll be yours. We'll come over and, uh, you know, buy stuff off you. If you're putting up a, a resort, oh, then we'll definitely be over. You know, that kind of thing. I don't know. You think, yeah, you think people would just say, hmm, all sorts of people getting hill, killed or we can do a compromise. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I can see, you know, when some invader, some invader comes marching through your, over your borders and, you know, wants to slaughter every man, woman, and child. Yeah, I think you got to stand up then and, uh, let them have it. But a lot of these things were, a lot of these battles were kind of over territory. I don't know. You, you think they just say, eh, <laughs> well, it would be, I would think everybody would be the better off for it. Get right down to it. Yeah. Well, what are you going to do? Anyway, I'll, I'll report back. It's uh supposed, I understand it's supposed to be a real good movie. I guess probably a lot of computer uh, generation and stuff to make it even, you know, even more realistic, I suppose. Uh, but again, my, my, I think my, um, feelings are don't have the battle in the first place, if you can help it, but it don't seem to work that way. Sort of a shame. The, um, it's, uh, I've never been in one, but I, I can't imagine they're too much fun. I remember once I was taken when I was a teenager, I was in Air Explorers. Yeah, Air Explorers, a Boy Scout. It's teenage Boy Scouts with airplanes. <laughs> and we went over to, uh, a, a, I think, an arsenal in uh, New Jersey, Picatinny Arsenal. And they were having some kind of um, Flag Day celebration, or it may have been even Memorial Day weekend. And they had a mock battle, uh, what it would be like... Uh, I think they lined all the spectators up on one hill and then across the hill, down down the valley from the hill where we, we were looking out over a valley and with a hill on the far side. Well, a valley. And they said they're going to reenact what it would look like to see uh, American troops coming your way. And they they actually had... Oh, and no one was allowed to go past a certain spot because there was... There was all sorts of things in the ground that were going to blow, going to blow up. And I, but the soldiers attacking knew where to avoid, so they weren't in any danger. But still, all of a sudden, here come, here come some scouts, here come some, I don't mean Boy Scouts, I mean scouts scouting out the land, then all of a sudden, uh, various other regiments of different kinds of soldiers for different purposes. Bombs started uh, landing and Shells started exploding amongst them as they marched forward, ever forward. 
pretty soon here comes a whole mess of uh, soldiers over the hill with uh, guns and bayonets, machine gun units opening up, and they're all like aiming at us. I mean, again, it was all blanks. It, there was, in fact, we weren't uh, it, we weren't in any danger. Although, if that was live ammunition, ammunition, I think we'd have been cooked. And it was, um, of course, uh, the shells the shells hitting, and again, it was. I don't know, but <laughs> and then guys came out of both sides, you know, like you know, to, to reinforce. I mean, it would have been would have been absolute pandemonium. It would have definitely been time for hands up. <laughs> and then after that, we all uh, they had a big picnic, so we could eat with the soldiers, and uh, yeah, we were all eating hot dogs and cheeseburgers. Much better way, you know. You think you would settle settle some at least some disputes between countries with maybe an eating contest. Send your send your be- send us your best glutton, and we'll bring our best glutton. They'll have an eating contest. They'll eat cheeseburgers. Whoever eats the most cheeseburgers. The you know the war is over, <laughs> and we'll all dance. Where's the girls? I I don't know. I would think that'd be way more fun, and 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 probably work out a whole lot better. You know, because next year you could have a dispute. Maybe next year, the following year you do it again, and now maybe your side gets the uh, you know the the country that lost. Maybe this time their their eaters were the best, and they uh, they they win the uh, win the field. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it it could it could really get to be a nice little uh, little thing going. Yeah, I mean, it's something you'd almost like to see spread. Yeah, yeah. I just thought I'd say I'll see you later. I'll let you know about the Battle of Waterloo. It's um, I imagine it's going to be intense. We'll see you later. Maybe I'll eat lunch afterwards. Okay. Well, we'll see you. Bye now.